Welcome to the channel. How are you doing? This is Lady B Unstoppable. If it's the first time, remember to subscribe. Anyways, this afternoon, afternoon or evening, this evening, I will be talking about some things. The title says, Step Up to Shape Up, but let me ears ring them there. Step up to shape up, but don't starve yourself. Don't fall out. Don't get sick. Dr. Mia Wagwan, fasting isn't starving. Good night. You got to know how to do this if you want to stay in shape or lose pounds. Yes, you are correct, Dr. Mia. So we're going to go ahead and share out the live. I'm not sure if YouTube share it out, so I'm going to do my part and share it out. So let's do this <laughs> well, let's do this yes so it is saturday and i am excited to be on here you know end of the week Mart martin luther king weekend holiday as i go so i have a three-day weekend all right so that is excellent So while I'm doing this, I don't have any background music right now. I have my headset just in case. As a matter of fact, let me go ahead and put the um put the link. Copy to clipboard. All right. Let me drop the link in here. For anybody who want to come up and join me, that would be greatly appreciated. All right, so let me see. We're going to do we're going to we're going to do a very quick check-in and I'm going to have have a list of things that we can based on the topic it said things that you can consume without falling out, without fainting. If you're gonna, you know, fast or you're on a weight loss journey, or you just generally not have nothing to eat, why that sounds terrible. All right, let me stop joke out this thing and just share the live. My thing is, I cannot multitask that well, so let me find my channel. All right, let me show Dr. Mia. Um, yes, so how was your week? And if you're watching me when um, I'm no longer live, just go and you're not yet. You're watching Oops. me when um... <laughs> and you're not yet subscribed, just go ahead and subscribe to the channel. In this cup, I am drinking. I guess, I bet nobody can guess what I'm drinking in this. Linford Quarry, how are you doing? Welcome. Can anybody guess what I'm drinking from this cup, this glass cup? I wish somebody can guess. Guess what I'm drinking out of this cup. Dr. Mia, guess what I'm drinking? Okay, you're in this pose. No problem. <laughs> no, not lemon water. Remember we had to... Well, I'm not going to do that. All right, so if we're going to give up, Dr. Mia said lemon water. No, Dr. Mia. Um, Linford Quarry, are you going to try to guess what I'm drinking out of this cup? You know, say I share me, I try to share this out from what for kill follow up. Tumory. <laughs> Good try. It's definitely outside the box. What I'm drinking is outside the box. I've never done it before. It's the first time I'm doing it. All right, so this is 
come over post ginger tea <laughs> all right so i steamed some broccoli a while ago and how i steam it i steam it in my copper chef steaming rack i use the steaming tray in the in my copper chef pot so you know when you steam those things the broccoli is not literally in the water it's on the, the the steaming tray but you're still gonna have water remaining in the container in the pot so miss i need to make some tea and let's go ahead and say let me just throw the hot water the remaining hot water so that's why i look green so I'm just drinking the steam water that left that's left from my um broccoli. I've never done it before, but that's a good way to still consume some of those things. And if it was if it was um beet I steam, the water would look red. So most time when I steam beets like that, I just Save the water, I use it to make my smoothie or shake or something like that. Yeah, I don't really waste it. Clove tea is, um, um, Linford Quarry said clove tea. It's broccoli water. Like, it's it's water from a steaming pot. Is, is that correct to say? It's water from a steaming pot. All right, so tonight I'm just going to talk about some foods we can consume to maintain stamina when we are on a fasting a weight loss or just generally to consume enough or to consume the right food for us to stay fuller longer um so if you are let me I'm still trying to share this out, guys. My bad. I'm still trying to share this out. For some reason, I'm not good at multitasking. I know me a teacher. I'm not good at multitasking. That kind of sad. <laughs> but I'm not good at multitasking. I think I've done it so much in my life. At this point, I decided I'm doing one thing at a time. So I've shared it on WhatsApp, I've shared it on YouTube, and now I'm going to share it on my Facebook real quick. And guys, please follow my Facebook page. It's called Lady Be Unstoppable, just like my YouTube channel, because I will be putting more stuff over there. I mean, I'll be premiering some videos over there as well. Just like our Unstoppable premiere um, videos and wrap a crap and all them other big vlogger day. So I'll be premiering. So if you miss it on YouTube and you still go watch it, you can go watch it on Facebook too. Yeah, man. So my page name, Lady B Unstoppable. Same like the one up here on YouTube. Yes. So that's what's up. So I'm sharing this on my page. This is what my page look like, guys. This is what my um my Facebook page look like. So I'm gonna go ahead and share it right now on this page. All right. So go ahead if you have not yet followed that page. Go ahead and follow that page. I'm also on Twitter at Lady Be Unstoppable. So continue. Oh, I didn't even put that title. Publish. Why the sharing take long still, you know? So um, for those who are just joining or those who are in the bushes, I will be talking about, uh, while Rich Big Up Herself, I'll be talking about some, first we're going to do a check-in. So um, I'll just basically talk, Dr. Mia is indisposable at this moment, so I'll just go ahead and run the thing. 
um for this week i did so much better this week i did not go on the scale to weigh but looking on my face i know i've lost some pounds because guys my face is getting back down to the regular shape probably that's not a good way to judge it but i know how my face looks so um with the bit when the other day my face was round a little bit rounder yeah um i decided that this week or the week that we just passed i was gonna be more serious these are the things i talk about or we talk about so in the mornings i made sure i had my lemon tea i have regular tea i have like you know herbal life tea with caffeine in the because i forget some caffeine i didn't have any coffee because me not i know coffee i did two shakes a day um i also consume more water i went to um sam's club and i bought propel that's one of the only water make sure no one well one back like it so even though i'm showing off and showing my big buckle um where you call it water um mm not mineral water what is buckler water the name again anyways the big buckler um what you okay alkaline water so even though i said i was gonna drink the alkaline water this one, the um, alkaline water, see the name, the pony there, alkaline. It did not um, work out. So I bought Propel and this water is zero calories, zero everything. It's a little flavored, zero sugar, zero this, zero that. I think we can't see so good because we can't find my good eyeglasses. It's a one little piece for me to buy a dollar tree. But anyway, yes, zero everything. I'm not advertising it because I'm not get paid for that, but I'm just telling you the one that works better for me. It has a little flavor in it. So that's the one I've been drinking all week. So I drink a lot more water than I would normally do. Still drink my tea, do my two shakes. And um, I did two shakes. One day I had soup. Another day, two days out of the week, I had salad. I bought the pack of kale salad. No, not kale, southwest salad, which I just added a piece of chicken breast. I had that. Um, and I had quinoa. One day I had quinoa with some chicken breast that I had stir fry. And what else? Not, not stir fry, but you know, yeah, kind of like stir fry. And what else I had? I don't know what. Um, all right, so that's basically what I had, but I did so much better. I try not to eat after 7.30. My goal was 5 o'clock, but it didn't work that way because, like, sometimes when I come home, it's already 5 o'clock. Um, so I try not to eat after 7.30, which worked for me probably a couple nights. Well, my camera looks so. couple nights, but then... Um, the other nights I ate earlier, the days when I cook and I mean, when I have leftovers, I ate earlier than the days when I have to cook. Chef Andre Davy, walk one, big up herself, long time no see. All right. So that's what I've been doing. Okay. So let me check my notes for what I initially planned to do. And let me put this on. Anybody want to come up here? You can, um, I'm going to pin the link. Anybody want to come up here? Look, my butter so you go. I'm gonna pin the link on my phone so you can come up if you want. But the topic is step up to shape up, but don't um, but don't clean the camera. Now use my hand cleanly. 
It's a type of camera where you zoom in and out. Is it better? You zoom in and you zoom out by, all by itself. I mean, I'm not touchy. It's a webcam thingy. Um, is that better? I hope so. All right, so I have a list of 10 things. Some of them might not. Thank you, uh, Dr. Me. Some of them might not sound. Let me take this off until when me, if somebody come up on me, I got talk to you. Some of them might not um, sound nutritious. However, it's all about um, consuming in moderation. So one of the first thing, foods to consume, as I look bright, it's too bright. Uh -uh. And with this, my have to touch it. All right. Foods to consume. Foods to consume for stamina, longevity. So the first one I have on my list is nuts. And this and some of the reasons I'm going to list it. Plus, I'm going to list some of the benefits of it. So if you are watching this when I'm no longer live, then, um, you know, you can use it to your advantage. However, make sure that you're not allergic to certain things. And if you are, don't consume it. So these are just some ideas that I have based on my research. So nuts gives you instant energy. It helps with endurance. It helps to improve blood flow. It's rich in omega-3 and fatty acids. So um, sometimes, mm, bite my lip. Sometimes we buy the fish oil to get the omega-3 and the fish, um, the, 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 what do you call that now? Anyway, the fish oil. If we consume enough nuts, then we probably can get our, we will get some omega 3 from that to improve health, energy, and working muscles. So, one of the main things is nuts. Now, how many ways can we do nuts? And, you know, in Jamaica, when not necessarily when I was growing up, because even now you will have peanut porridge. You have a man in the street where sell peanut porridge. You also have um, you have peanut punch. People make their own punch and put peanut in it. Peanut soup. So there are so many different things you can do. Kizzy walk one. You can do with nuts, right? So that helps with endurance to maintain your hunger or to help you with hunger. Another one of my, I eat you now sometimes when I come home, let's say uh, I would bring a shake to school. Then during the day, I would have probably a banana or if I already have banana in my smoothie, if I make a smoothie and not a shake, I will have um. I will just have a handful of nuts, not necessarily a full, full handful, but I will have nuts and I will also have um, water. So when I have the nuts, then I would feel a little bit fuller or, you know, I won't be extremely hungry. I just buy some cloves to make tea. Okay, Kizzy, yeah, man, the cloves. Cloves, good. Um... Chef Andre said, good vibes. Dr. Mia said, clean the... Oh, me do that already. All right. Um, right. Let's see. I'm just going through. Yeah, me know say cloves. Yeah, talk. Brown rice. Now, I have not had rice. Rice was off my... Um, what you call it? Rice was off my menu for the week. So, I did not have rice. However, you can have brown rice. Because if you're doing a lifestyle and certain things, you probably might want to let stay in your diet if you want this to be a lifestyle type thing. So brown rice versus white rice. Brown rice has, it's, it has carb, but it also is lower in starch and is high in fiber. Fiber it's, is what really keeps you fuller for longer. And that's based on my research. Don't take my word for it. Do your own research. All right, when I'm too close to the camera, sure, I have an office. So, yes, um, helps keep your stomach fuller for longer. 
It is rich in protein, vitamin B complex. It helps to maintain stamina. One thing, I have not been cooking brown rice, rice because to me it takes long to cook. So I do something that's quicker to cook, like quinoa. I would do quinoa a lot. I, I, have, I consume quinoa, quinoa a lot every day. Right now I have some I'm going to have. I'm going to eat late tonight, but I'll be off here by about 9, 9.15 or so. I mean, probably by 9 o'clock. So I'll, you know, probably don't eat later than 9.15. Because I'm not going to go to sleep till probably about 12 o'clock. So I will still have some hours before I go to sleep. All right. Yeah, Kizzy. <laughs> I'm a real ear this, my dear child. But me, you, know, you don't know. With the weather and all of that, I can't really wear it out. Because number one, outside cool. I mean, I want to catch cool in my skull. So... Eggs. Eggs is another one. I love eggs. I do boiled eggs. I do um, stir fry eggs. I do stir fry eggs. Probably so. With spinach, I do scrambled eggs. Eggs is very high in protein. Some people blend the eggs and drink it. I can't do that. Um, I've never tried that. So some people blend the eggs and drink it. So you have um, protein. Eggs is good in Eggs good in um, high quality protein, positive balance, energy balance, repair muscles, improve exercise endurance. Eggs also have, <laughs> kids, they are easy. Eggs also have um, vitamin D, B6, B12, zinc, iron, copper. Mm. Well, this is. Since this get quality, it's kind of nasty. All right. Uh, eggs help with the metabolism and it helps with protein. All right. So that's what's up. So far, I've gone three things that we can consume to maintain stamina to keep our bodies from getting hungry so we don't fall out, so we don't drop down. Um, I remember when I was growing up and I was doing, I wasn't fat. I was always slim. Right now, me get fat. I was always slim. And I still used to do herbal life. I remember this one time when I did herbal, when I did the um the shake. At that time, I didn't know much about the extra protein powder. I may I tell us say, I used to feel so hungry because I was trying to do the weight loss, but I didn't realize that. I was lacking in protein. I was an adult, you know, still trying to maintain my weight and all of that. And that time I wasn't fat. I was about 100 pounds. I've never been more than 100. When we live in Jamaica, me never more than 110 pounds. And since me come up here now, me get um, put on extra weight. I let bust down 135 and them something there. Yeah, I was never um, this. Heavy, if you, if you can't call it that. So um, I know it's something. I know I've, I'm from slim jeans, so it's gonna be easy for me to lose weight. Moving on to the next. I say it's my let me still have something on this door. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Oh no, I'm not in the store. I thought I was still cooking. So what's the so? All right, so moving on to the next topic. Fish. Fish, in, fish is another one, or then call it swim around. Let me just use the word swim around to be on the safe side. Um, so one of those or two of those could be salmon, tuna. These have protein. You this have protein, okay. Well, which this have protein, vitamin B, fatty acids as well. Um, and the protein helps to maintain your hunger, so it's always good to get enough protein. So, if you're snacking on anything, um, during your in between meals, 
make sure it's a protein if you're going to have an apple try have apple with peanut butter or something like that you know sweet potato is another one um we can use or we can consume sweet versus white potato right steady energy supply longer to digest it has far um carbs and fiber and fiber as i said is what keeps you fuller longer and when the um product that you consume takes longer to digest it keeps you full so it's easier for you to um it's harder for you to get hungry quick and then eat all kind of junk food another one is green leafy vegetable and as i say green leafy vegetable i'll be doing some green green mm, green juice i'll be doing green juice i have kale lime cucumbers um them over there so may i look on it they're on my counter because i'm gonna do it as soon as i'm done so i'm not gonna be up here that long um as well as what else celery yeah fruits is also something we can consume and probably i might just go over there and do it while i'm live yeah that's a good idea i can use my ipad get on the stream and do it while i'm live yeah all right because i'm not gonna just be talking 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 all right so the next thing fruits is very good to consume such as banana apple grapes citrus strawberries avocado and kiwi fruits give you um potassium carb antioxidant calcium dietary fiber and vitamin c coffee is another one you can consume if you're a coffee person if you're not a coffee person leave it alone um if you're not a coffee person don't even worry about it all right i am really not a coffee person but i do drink coffee sometimes it gives instant energy boost caffeine stimulate and energizes your brain keeps you alert and active um and they're saying one cup helps to trigger the nervous system. Yep. All right, moving on to the next one, dark chocolate. And as I said earlier, some of these might sound as if they are not healthy. However, I always hear that dark chocolate is good for you. It has antioxidants. It helps with mental energy as well. And it contains cocoa so that's not um you know like we have cocoa in jamaica well probably you can get cocoa to buy here as well i no problem wild rich no watch no um no watch no face and remember what i'm saying is make sure that you know what you're allergic to what you're not allergic to i'm not that professional nutritionist i'm just saying things based on my research and also based on my personal preference then we have continuing continuing with the dark chocolate we have um what some some of the things it helps with it improves circulation in the body and oxygen oxygen supply to the muscles oh yeah Talking about that, I'm definitely going to do my um, exercise tonight. Bean is another thing that is important or that can be consumed to maintain a health, not, uh, not necessarily healthy, a f um, stamina in terms of keeping you fuller for longer. And some of these include a black bean or black eyed peas black black eyed peas yes um is excellent source of protein because a lot of persons who are vegetarians or vegans beans is a part of their diet and sometimes oh, i want to going over john shop and sometimes i also do um beans as well i do chickpeas yeah i do chickpea as well 
So those are some of the things. That's all I have for tonight. And um, but those persons are gonna watch this video when I'm no longer live. Make sure when you're looking at these products that I mentioned, you um, you know, just to kind of ensure that you are not allergic to any of them. For example, I mentioned nuts. Make sure you're not allergic to nuts and it's something you can consume. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna let this, I'm gonna go ahead and do my, um, my green juice. I'm gonna just let this stay up here and I probably do join my own stream and do my green juice while I'm, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm just not in the mood to, um, cut this off yet. So I'm just gonna let this roll, probably play some YouTube music in the background. I'm going to cut my camera off as well. So let me put this, um, let me put this link right here. So guys, go ahead and check out my videos. I also, I'm going to have a couple of videos I'm going to put up tonight. I have two videos I need to drop tonight. They are I've already, um, as a matter of fact, me, I go schedule one of them right about now. You're not sure how you make it. My green juice, Kizzy. What you talking My green juice? We can't do it still because them over there are just for me for join the live. And bring my um iPad over there. I can do that. So another thing, just a little update on my channel. Um oh the juice. <laughs> Yeah, I can make it. I definitely forgot to eat now because my um my hungry. And I'm making quinoa. I'm not do, eat nothing fancy. I'm gonna do quinoa and I'm gonna do some beans and some broccoli. I'm already have it. Me just for um just for consume it, you know. I'm trying to put the link up here so I can hit it, hit the link and, and, um, get on it and do my juicing. Okay. So this, okay. Let me pin the link here. Why isn't it letting me pin it? Oh, here it is. Pin message. All right, so I'm going to pin it so I can. Um, I'm going to prepare my stuff over here. So. All right, we're gonna go over this side and get my stuff straight. I'm not 
recording? Why is it recording? Then paper the knives in my store. They are so nice in my store. I tell you. I'm going to go ahead and end this stream and um, do my thing, do my other two videos. So, guys, if you're watching this when I'm no longer live, I want you to go ahead. Make sure you subscribe if you have not yet subscribed to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I go live or whenever I upload a new video. Thank you for watching. Stay safe. <laughs>